The reason I share my story is because with the recovery community, that was one of the biggest ways you can go and help someone. If someone now realizes that they're able to go out and get that help that they need, then lose the stress like I lost the stress, then that's, that's the greatest tool, I think. I was into drugs pretty heavily. It was a long, long stretch of addiction, so. My debt was thousands of dollars in payday loans. I'd get my paycheck from work, and then I'd instantly be paying back my payday loan. Once I got into that circle, it was, it was over. I was in a pretty bad spot. Uh, went to rehab. We just basically learned how to live again. But then it was sort of dulled it down by knowing, well, I have thousands of dollars I gotta pay off. I was afraid of how, how am I gonna afford this? How am I gonna live a normal life after addiction? But I still have all this money I gotta pay back. When I left Sands and Associates, I, I felt relieved. The quick response, it wasn't like a couple of days, it was literally that next day they responded back to me. And in the, within the week I was in an office and we were talking about my situation and telling me that, yeah, there is hope and like you will be able to get out of this. They could stop my wage garnishment and I could keep my apartment. My future looks bright. I, I'm, I'm, every day I get up, go to work, I have a place to live. I know my debt's being managed. With, with the help from Sands and Associates, I was able to continue uh, with one of my passions, which is umpiring baseball, get back, do what I love, uh, mentor the younger kids uh, on the field, and just uh, try and give back to the community. Biggest lesson I learned from being helped at Sands and Associates would be just, just to ask for the help. I should have done it years earlier.